Hello, Man of You family. Um, my name is Adonia Williams, and it is truly an honor to be invited to do devotionals with you all. Um, since I graduated, I've been at Regent University pursuing a law school um, career. And one of the scriptures that I've been holding on to with two hands, just two hands, is Psalm 119, uh, verse 71. You know, before I go into the verse, it like school in general or for other people who are not a full-time student, um, career student like myself, um, you experience times of where you just kind of feel hard pressed. You feel a little crushed on every side. For me, it's usually during finals. Um, for you, maybe you have a family member you're gonna see this summer or you have a friend you need to talk to. And so, this scripture really reminds me of those times. And it says that it is good for me that I was afflicted, that I might learn your statutes. So just to kind of dive in, afflicted in Hebrew is anah. And it means to be afflicted. It means to be pushed down, turned down, um, or to be bent over, to be humbled. Um, and two things when we are in that position of being afflicted is number one is you're repositioned. And a lot of times that's very uncomfortable because it's not like you're choosing to be repositioned. Sometimes maybe it's a life decision you did or maybe it's just things that's outside of your own control. Life has a way of afflicting us. But the second thing is it makes us do research, which is, <laughs> very some very much something I am used to. It makes you research, okay, God, what are you doing? And another interesting thing about this is about a statue is with statues, you interpret a statue by a law that is already known. And so here you have the psalmist saying that when he is humbled, when we are humbled, it helped us to learn the statutes of God. It helped us to know the things that God has already revealed to us about Him. So when you're in those hard pressed times, what is it that you already know about God? Do some research. Well, we know that God is good and He only does good for us that we know that he has a plan for us. We know that he loves us. We know that he's for us and not against us. We know he's faithful. And those things that he told us we can endure, we, we can. And so whether you're not in a crushing season or whether you just finish a crushing season, it happens. But we can know that it teaches us about who God is, and He's faithful. So thank you for joining with me, sharing with me, and I would love to pray for us. So Father God, we just thank you. We thank you that during times of affliction, of our being humbled, you are for us, and you teach us who you are in those moments. We love you, and we are just thankful for you. In Jesus' name, amen.